real run off to. He's watching for trouble. Relax. He'll be back soon. You are strong and they are weak. <laughs> what is this? Ryu, what's going on? What's happening? <laughs> Luna! Damn it! Snap out of it, Ryu! I was getting tired of this charade. How do you feel? Master. Poison finally kicked in. Take them away. Master, please don't leave us. Our motley crew is bound to draw attention. All right, here's the plan. You, Huan, and Zheng Yu scout the next sector and activate the bridge. I'll stay here with the Empress and our new special friend. Reinforcements are probably on their way, so work fast. Think you can handle this? I'm on it. Please be careful, warrior. We'll search this, this way, Jiang. Please take Her Majesty to the quarantine sector.
trying to protect me. If he... if I... Liar? You're a liar, just like Ryu! Master... I don't understand. Ryu, he, he just... he... It all happened so fast. I couldn't get to him in time. I couldn't save Bunyang. But it was Ryu. I thought he was one of us. I didn't even know we were in danger. I couldn't help Bunyang. I promised I would keep everyone safe, and I couldn't. I'm sorry, Master. I didn't know what to do. I... couldn't stop him. I'm sorry, Master. From now on, I won't let anyone get to Buna or Jin Soyeon. Especially Ryu. Yes, Master. Master? Wait. Bun Yang's really gone, isn't he? C can I ask a favor, Master? We were in a hurry earlier, and Bun Yang left some things behind at the hideout. It's all that's left. Thank you. I think maybe Buna might feel better if she has something to, to remember him by. Oh, I'll be okay. I need to be brave for them. For Bunyang, too. Reunited at last. I know your hearts ache now. But at least you are together again. That pain will never go away, but you need to stay strong. The children need you. You cannot blame yourself, warrior. They love you, but they are hurting. Then let me ease your burden. The little one mentioned something left behind? I can take the children to this hideout while you stop the Dowager. The Nameless will protect us. Unless you would prefer to have a Talus Empress and three children following you. Right. You do what you can to stop the Dowager, and I promise your children and I will be safe in the hideout, don't worry. Thank you, old friend. Please be careful. Kids shouldn't have to watch their friends die. I know it's hard to see them like this. At least we know they're safe. There's a certain type of guilt that comes when you watch someone die and you're left among the living. If we still have life, we must have it for a reason. If nothing else, we must try to keep others from suffering the fate of our fallen friends. It seems the Dowager will do anything to consolidate her power, even if it means spilling the blood of the people she's sworn to protect. Perhaps it's time the Stratus Throne was returned to the true Stratus lineage. If she is who you say she is, yes. The only way to be certain is with the Wandi Compass. Do you remember Mushin's compass? This works the same way. The Wandi compass can verify that Namsoyu is of royal Stratus lineage. It was entrusted to General Hondu when Mushin's compass was stolen by Guihan. Of course, the general was still the Imperator then. Princess or not, let's get her out of this dump. Out of the frying pan. Looks like word of our prison break got out before we did. In the eyes of the Empire, you and your friend are escaped convicts. I guess that makes me the traitor that set you free. What an honor. The good news is that General Hondu's estate isn't far. The bad news is that it's surrounded by soldiers, mostly of the young, brash, stab first and ask questions later variety. Whatever happens, don't let them take Namsoyu. Captain, I think we've been spotted. We have you surrounded. Surrender or face the wrath of the, the Stratus, Stratus Elite, Elite Guard. Guard. Who is this guy? We'll handle this. Please stay back. Thank you. Be careful. The quicker we deal with them, the fewer reinforcements we face later. Are you all right? We're fine. Thank you. It's an honor, your honor. Watch out! There's more coming! Halt! Drop your weapons! We don't have time for this. I hate to do this, Don't let them escape. Me much choice, soldier. Let us through! I'm good. Yes, Captain. I have no qualms with you, soldier. I hate to do this, Out of our way. not leaving me much choice, soldier. Shh, keep it down. Most of the soldiers are heading toward the prison, but it looks like the guards have doubled up as well. Either that, or General Hondu has become paranoid. The authorities should still be under the assumption that we're trying to escape or hide. The home of a disgraced high-profile general should not be a place of interest. I'll scale this wall and open the east gate. You're welcome to come if you like. 
Sure, why not? You were with me the last time I broke into the home of a high-ranking government official. Let's hope things go smoother this time around. Keep an eye on Her Majesty. We'll secure the courtyard. Meet us at the East Gate. Yes, Captain. Watch your step. This courtyard has seen better days. General Hondu has really let this place go. Either that or the Dowager has cut off any funds to maintain the grounds. Either way, his guards are still here, and they aren't going to let us through in light of recent events. If we're going to see the General, we're going to have to take out his guards. Just subdue and silence them. Don't kill them. Too many have died already. In time, they'll understand. Let's get this over with. Move aside. You don't know what you're doing. Okay, open the East Gate. If I recall, there's a side exit that leads to his office. Hurry, let's go. Wait! There are guards at that gate as well. It was bound to happen. Princess, uh, I mean, uh, your majesty, please stay back while we subdue these guards. You two stay near the exit and keep a sharp eye. Yes, Captain. No problem. And who in the realms are you? You! You've got two seconds to talk! General Hondu, please forgive our intrusion. I would not have come to you like this if it were not a matter of utmost urgency. What could possibly justify this insanity? With all due respect, General, I believe this warrior may be able huh? to explain better this than I can. This is the prisoner who escaped? You dare to enter my quarters after flaunting the law and breaking out of prison? That's either courage or full-on stupidity. All right. You've got my attention. What is it you have to say? Divine mandate ceremony. You're more than stupid. You're insane. You expect me to defy the Dowager and stop the ceremony? Enough of this. An escaped convict speaking of treason deserves no audience from me. I should run you through where you stand. Perhaps the prison wardens won't execute you outright if you surrender. But I wouldn't count on it, especially if you mention this divine mandate madness. The Dowager is deceiving us all, General. This woman may be living proof. Is that so? What's this proof you speak of? You fill this palace with even more lies! And who might you be? Another member of this circus? I am Nam Soyu, lost daughter of Nam Selin, and the rightful inheritor of the Stratus lineage. Ha! This has gone from insanity to a complete farce. I call your bluff. I happen to have something which will expose your lies. The Wan D Compass. Prove you're the rightful heir with your blood. Even if what you say is true, this heir, Nam Soyu, is no solution. She only adds to the problem. The Dowager will either use her or kill her. I know the Dowager is power-hungry and foolish enough to attempt the Divine Mandate Ceremony. But even a man in my position cannot stop it. She is too powerful, has too many loyalists. Your best option may be to petition the Prince directly, especially if he and Nam Soyu share a bloodline. 
Arranging a meeting is the right thing to do. But that's the extent of my goodwill. If Prince Subin refuses to listen, you must leave Gunwan and never return. This Dowager is madness. Tehu and the Ebon Drake have put the entire Empire at risk. She's evil, General, and she's deceived you all. Evil is only defined by whoever is in power. Even if what you say is true, how will you expose an entrenched evil such as the Dowager? Princess Namsu, you may change things. For now, I'll keep her hidden and safe. Good. We cannot allow Namsoyu to fall into the Dowager's hands. As for you, I will take you to the Inner Keep to meet Prince Subin, and we'll settle this one way or another. All of you, stay safe. Yes, General. Thank you. Fine. Open the door. I only hope we arrive in time. One thing you should know before we start this foolishness? The inner keep is past the North Guard post. The guards verify the identity of anyone they don't recognize. I can deal with the guards at the entrance, but the guard captain is another story. I trained him well. He'll insist on doing things by the book. That said, I do have one idea. I can introduce you to the captain as the member of a potential military alliance. Matters for the proper military override palace guard concerns. Or at least I hope they will. If we fail, he won't hesitate to turn his guards on you. But if you stick to the script, we might just get out of this with our heads. Come on. Stay behind me. Chief General, what are you doing here at this hour? I have an urgent message for the guard captain. Sir, this is most unorthodox. It's an important matter, so I came myself. Open the door. But your guest doesn't have clearance. Not to worry. This one is with me. I mean no disrespect. I don't like repeating myself. This is urgent. Of course, sir. All right. Here's where sword hits shield. The guard captain approaches. Remember what I told you. The guard post may be on high alert about the prison escape. Don't break the disguise, or we're done for. Chief General, what are you doing here at this hour? I must speak to the prince. Well, of course, but with guests? But sir, your guest isn't expected. I appreciate your diligence, but this is a very special guest of the military. I regret having to pull rank, but trust that this meeting is crucial to our efforts. I see. I will speak to your guest directly. Excuse me. I certainly trust Chief General Hondu, but understand we need to verify the identity of anyone passing through the post. Were you invited by letter or decree? How did you come to enter the palace in the first place? Ah, you are part of the diplomatic group from Zaiwe. Uh, in that case, Empress Tehu made it expressly clear yesterday, in anticipation of your arrival, that you are to remain in the pavilion. The inner keep in particular is off limits. I'll need a letter from the Empress or Minister Janyong to allow you entry. I regret this misunderstanding. Chief General, I'm sorry, I cannot allow your guest in. You don't understand what's at stake, Guard Captain. The very continuation of the Stratus Empire hinges upon this meeting. I swear to you on my life, no harm will come to the Prince. I... All right, General Hondu, but I insist on accompanying you. Guard, what's going on? C Captain, we're overrun. The Evan Drake! Breathe, son, breathe. Tell me what's happening. I see only death will buy your silence. <laughs> Bastard. Our ascension is foretold.
Eppendrake here? The Prince! I must head inside the inner keep. Guard Captain, assemble all the guards you can muster and sound the alarm! <laughs> yes, sir. Pure evil. How could this happen? How have Ebendrake cultists infiltrated this far into the palace? If the Ebendrake have invaded the inner keep, their target is clear. The royal quarters and the prince! Prince Subin has essentially been under house arrest courtesy of the Dowager. He's trapped, but I will not let him die. Not today. Come. Hurry! The guards. Dead. All dead. I've seen this strange aura before. Dark Chi. Whoever did this will pay. The Ebendrake. They were welcomed by the Dowager as honored guests and advisors. We must make absolutely sure the Ebendrake are behind this. Could you help me search the bodies? The cult's power has only increased within the palace. They have powerful allies. We need hard proof. Examine the manner in which they died. See if the Ebendrake left any trace of their misdeeds. Even the smallest detail could prove important. Carefully now. The bodies are mutilated! Those monsters! You'll regret this, murderer! It's the Ebendrake! I'm sure of it! Enemies are everywhere. As such, it is imperative to protect the royal quarters and our dear Prince Subin. Henceforth, no one is allowed inside the royal quarters except for royal guards and trusted servants personally selected by me. Violators will be caught and killed. Do not disappoint me, Tehu. What is their overall scheme, I wonder? I didn't like the Ebon Drake the moment they moved into the palace. Freaks and zealots, all of them. Beyond the immediate mission of rescuing the Prince, we are in a perilous position. Is the Dowager in league with these monsters? Or would she do the right thing if approached? In any case, we must hurry to the Prince. He is surely in grave danger. I only hope we arrive in time. It's as quiet as the dead here. No night guards. The royal quarters are usually packed with servants in attendance of the Prince, who is in poor health. The Ebon Drake stench is all over this. This parchment, it implicates the Dowager. Damn it, I knew it. Only the Dowager could have arranged for the inner keep to be so empty. She wants no witnesses to her evil deeds. Attacking Prince Subin is bad enough, but the Dowager plots something even more insidious with the Divine Mandate. We must expose it. The Assassin! Your intrusion ends here, Hondu. Filthy zealot! Out of the way! I'll enjoy bleeding the life from you. Halt! You answer to me! Admit defeat! Kneel! You will pay the ultimate price for your trespass! I'll enjoy bleeding the life from you. Be gone, betrayers! No time to waste. Let's go! Is that all you've got? All Is that shall all perish. you've got? The Ebon Drake will rise and consume you! I'm impressed you made it this far. Your pain will be particularly sweet. You stain this place with your evil. On my life, you shall not harm the prince. Justice will win the day! You are nothing! Heaven Drake will rise and consume you! You alright? More, eh? Ha! Come at me! You 
all right? Wait. <laughs> 